Welcome back to the channel guys. <clears throat> um, today we've got another Range Rover TDV6, SDV6 or whatever you want to call them in for a cam belt kit and an alternator because it isn't charging properly. So if we have a look here, I've already partly stripped it down. As you can see, I've already sh partly stripped it down. The horrible thing is, there's the alternator tucked right in there. So I'm hoping I'm going to be able to undo the bolts and it's going to just sort of come out. Hopefully. But we shall see. So I've got the old alternator out. What a pig. Mainly because. that there sits right around the back and you've got no movement and I mean I'm a bit annoyed the customer opted for the cheaper option of getting a second hand one so I really hope this works because I don't want to be taking it back out if you look here it sits in that hole the alternator sits around the back of this and then there's the there's the power wire so it's not a fun job I wouldn't even attempt that. If I were a mechanic, I wouldn't attempt that. Not nice. But yeah, I suppose we get better get this other one back in. Oh, when it's all back in. I don't usually swear on this channel, but I'll tell you what, that is a bitch of a job. You have to take the power steering pump off, I think that is whatever pump that is down there at the bottom so you can get to the bottom alternator bolts but now it's time to do the cam belt so I think we're going to time lapse Cam belt's all back on, all now timed up. I've turned it over already. So I suppose we'll go back to a time lapse while I put it back together. All done guys, just got to put that top cover back on and then obviously the engine cover but I'm going to leave that till tomorrow because I've got to let it cool down now so I can top cool it up in the morning. So yeah, but make sure you subscribe to the channel, click that little notification bell, uh, keep an eye out for the next video and have a good day.